Hello, everyone. May you be blessed in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Today's topic is five ways to be successful in your life. Success is a progressive method. It goes gradually. It takes determination, perseverance, and patience. People want to be successful, but they want sudden success, which doesn't happen that way. No one wants to be a failure. People have been gaining success while some are not. There are methods and procedures one must observe if he wants to be successful in life. Number one is never be a mediocre. Don't try to be a mediocre in your work because nobody wants something of low quality or value. People tend to go after things, things that are extraordinary and classic. Never allow mediocrity to come into your path of success. Number two is avoid procrastination. Procrastination is a thief of time. Because if you delay or what you are supposed to do at the moment, it will take a longer time to do it again. Once you decided to do something, don't allow your mind to be withered by procrastination, by allowing yourself to postpone to another time. Because it might prompt you to postpone it again if you want to do it on the earlier agreed postponement. Putting off an action leads to time wasting. If something is necessary, it is best to act quickly to accomplish it. Number three here is be determined. Determination is the key to success. Staying focused in your life can help to be successful. Okay? Always focus on what you want to do. Okay, and again, if you focus on what you do, you'll be able to do it very fast. Making up your mind and holding on to it, holding on to it firm will help you. There is no difficulty we can't overcome if we are wrongly determined to keep in pushing, no matter what it takes. Another one is work hard and work smart. Work hard and work smart. The idea that you should work smarter, not only harder, isn't anything new. When talking about the differences between smart and hard work, it's pretty simple to explain what working hard means. If you want to be successful in the long run, you have to put long hours into work. You have to start early, before all other people, and you have to stay up late. When everyone else is already enjoying the afternoons and evenings. On the other hand, it's really hard to find very clear guidelines on what working smart really means and how it's different from hard work. It's very obvious that even if you are determined that nobody will outwork you, you still have maximum limits regarding working hours that you reach pretty fast. And there's always someone who is willing to sleep less than you. On top of that, many people work hard, but only a few become really successful. That's because smart work is what makes the difference. But what is really their secret that the others don't know when getting down to work? Let's look at the main elements of smart work, from the most obvious ones to the most concealed ones that find tune smart work and can take your success level a step further. Below you can find 30 elements of smart work. No smart worker has all of them, but the more elements you manage to implement into your working strategy and style, the smarter worker you will become. From physical to creative work, life management skills, time management skills, understanding the system and the theory you operate on, knowing what you want, being in the right industry, providing scarce resources to markets with a high demand, looking on the bright side of life, carefully selecting the right opportunities, thinking before acting, exploiting the halo effect, 
focusing on creating, delivering, and capturing value. Okay, innovating and being bold, having control, helping people to manage their money, creating intellectual property or products, and unfair advantages, standing on the shoulders of giants, being proactive and having emotional control, networking and asking for help, putting yourself first, considering limits, hanging out with the best people possible, building on your strength, keeping short-term and long-term perspective, such execution and politics, the right timing, know when to cut your losses, being agile and adaptable, prestige giving back to the community. But one element of smart work is knowing when to take time and focus yourself on acquiring and implementing new important knowledge that can unlock your potential and make you much more successful in many areas of life. Invest in yourself. This is very, very important. You want to be a success, you have to invest in yourself. You will ask me how. You do that by taking a time out to improve yourself by acquiring more skills, knowledge and creativity. Much more like working smartly. Investing in yourself can help you to boost you more because your value increases if you take out to spread your roots to take more knowledge and skills. Let me just conclude here. If you really want to be successful, you have to be versatile and follow these rules because this it will help it's very helpful to you on your way as you climb the ladder of success success is there for you to achieve just listen to this video and may the lord bless you in jesus name